Hi there, let me introduce you to the concept of multiplexing, what it is and why you should care about it. But first, let's go through some contextualization. This here is an optical fiber. Nowadays, 99% of data traffic in the world goes through optical fiber networks and the demand for faster data transfer grows every single day. At first, people could handle the excess network traffic by laying more cables, but then in the 90s, the internet came along and changed everything. Traffic started to grow exponentially, so people had to come up with more efficient ways of using already existing networks. So that's when they came up with the idea of multiplexing. Multiplexing basically is the technique of cramming more signals through one fiber. Let me show you a little demonstration. Now imagine that the corridor is the fiber and I am the signal. Watch what happens when there is multiplexing. For multiplexing to work, it is very important to distinguish the different signals sent to the optical fiber. In the example, I, the signal, was distinguished through clothes. One of the ways of distinguishing light signals through a fiber is using different wavelengths for each signal. At the end of the fiber, every signal has its own receiver, and this is called wavelength division multiplexing. The graph I'm drawing helps explain how this technique helped increase transfer speeds through the years. Nowadays, the global communication infrastructure is achieving data rates in excess of 50 terabytes per second, using hundreds of wavelengths through a single fiber core. The amount of data accumulated by people doubles every three years. For example, there is 16 years of video uploaded to YouTube every single day. Fortunately, the computing power of the world doubles every one and a half years, but to be able to compute that data, we need to be able to transfer it. So this is why it's so important to unlock the full potential of optical networks. In conclusion, multiplexing is important because it's the most effective way of increasing the capacity of current and future optical networks.